lot of joy, a lot of beauty, you know, a lot of very interesting, intelligent people, a lot of strong culture, and also a lot of violence and a lot of social issues and a lot of uh, social exclusion from the mainstream, you know, lack of education, lack of health care, uh, lack of job opportunities. So it's a place that's, you know, has a lot of good and a lot of bad. I'm basically going to explore that through this mural. Felipe, this is the kid that I, uh, that the mural, he's, he's the main character of the mural. Uh, I lived with him and his family when I lived in the city of God in Brazil. Uh, so he's basically the representation of children in, you know, in the favela, in poor communities, having to live with uh, very violent situations, but still being kids and playing and having their dreams and hopes. So. Uh, we were very close because his father was killed, uh, so, you know, me being in the house, I was the only adult male in the house, so he started calling me dad within a couple weeks and stuff, so we got very close, and hopefully I'll be able to visit him again soon. I want people to know from the first day that it's going to be something good, that they're going to like, that's of quality, so I try to make sure the first thing I do on the mural, I leave it at the end of the day with something that looks at least, you know, pretty good, pretty decent. People always like to, to know what's going on when they see a mural going up. That's one reason I like doing outdoor public art, because you meet a lot of people. gonna have it's not all done yet obviously but on the left side you're gonna see the the police with the you know with their guns and and, and you're gonna see the traffickers which are like teenage guys that walk around and, and then there's also a lot of joy happiness families uh, very strong culture you know so it's gonna kind of just show all that like a balance of what what his life is like and you see his grandmother there who's like worried about him Well, I sketched out to begin with, uh, but I always also improvise and change things around a little bit, just depending on what I feel is gonna look good. Public art like this can be really great to get kids involved with. It gives them a feeling of being part of the community, uh, having a, you know, if they have a message or something they want to get across, they can do that through the art. So I think overall it's really positive. Finding the beauty in a place uh, you know, whether it's D.C. or whether it's Brazil or anywhere, you know, finding the beauty, bringing people together through the arts, uh, sharing through the arts, showing the beauty of a place that a lot of people, when they talk about uh, certain places that are impoverished, that have a lot of violence, they only focus on that. And this mural is to show that that is the reality there, but there is also another reality that's just as important to show, which is the positive side, you know, the culture, the beauty, and that's a really important part of what uh, Bloom Bars does, and what I, also what I try to do with my art.